The rise of fascism in Europe serves as a profound cautionary tale, reminding us of the fragile nature of democracy and the dangerous potential of authoritarian ideologies. In recent years, we have seen a resurgence of far-right movements driven by a complex interplay of economic distress, social unrest, and political disillusionment. This script will explore the historical context, current trends, contributing factors, and the vital lessons we must learn to safeguard democracy against the allure of fascism. Historical Context Fascism first emerged in Europe in the early 20th century, gaining traction during periods of economic hardship and social upheaval. The aftermath of World War I created fertile ground for authoritarian ideologies, particularly in countries that felt humiliated or economically strained. Benito Mussolini's Italy and Adolf Hitler's Germany exemplified how charismatic leaders could manipulate public sentiment, using propaganda and nationalism to build support. Both regimes suppressed dissent and employed violent tactics against perceived enemies, leading to significant loss of life and liberty. Mussolini emphasized the need for a strong, centralized government and the importance of national identity, a theme echoed by contemporary far-right movements. His rise to power showcased the dangers of complacency in the face of rising extremism, with the populace yearning for stability and order amid chaos. This historical context highlights the necessity for vigilance in protecting democratic values. Current Trends In the present day, Europe is witnessing a troubling resurgence of far-right movements and parties. Countries such as Hungary, Poland, and Italy have seen significant support for right-wing parties that often rely on nationalistic rhetoric and anti-immigrant sentiments. Viktor Orbán's government in Hungary is particularly noteworthy for facing criticism for undermining democratic norms by consolidating power, eroding judicial independence, and limiting press freedom. In Italy, the rise of the Brothers of Italy party, led by Giorgia Maloney, signals a shift toward more nationalistic and right-wing policies. Maloney's platform emphasizes traditional values, strict immigration controls, and a strong national identity. This shift reflects broader trends across Europe, where citizens increasingly seek radical solutions to perceive threats to their identity and security. Economic and Social Factors Several economic and social factors contribute to the resurgence of fascism in Europe. The COVID-19 pandemic has intensified economic uncertainty, leading to rising unemployment, inflation, and an overall sense of instability. Many individuals feel marginalized by mainstream political parties, prompting them to support populist leaders who promise radical solutions to their problems. Economic hardship breeds resentment, particularly against marginalized groups such as immigrants and refugees. Scapegoating is a hallmark of fascist movements, which capitalize on societal fears and frustrations to galvanize support. Research shows that areas with higher unemployment rates are more likely to experience support for far-right parties, suggesting a direct correlation between economic distress and the appeal of authoritarian ideologies. Social media has also played a significant role in the rise of far-right movements, providing platforms for extremist ideologies to flourish. Algorithms that prioritize sensational content often amplify divisive narratives, allowing misinformation and propaganda to spread rapidly. This digital landscape enables far-right leaders to connect with disillusioned citizens and foster a sense of community around shared grievances. Lessons and Warnings The rise of fascism in contemporary Europe serves as a stark reminder of the importance of protecting democratic values and human rights. Historical examples demonstrate how quickly democracy can deteriorate into authoritarianism when citizens become disillusioned with traditional political structures. In the 1930s, Many democracies failed to recognize the warning signs of fascism, leading to catastrophic consequences. To prevent a repeat of history, it is crucial to educate the public about the dangers of fascism and promote inclusive dialogue. Civic education plays a vital role in empowering citizens to recognize and resist authoritarian tendencies. Encouraging participation in democratic processes, such as voting and community engagement, can help strengthen democratic institutions and mitigate the appeal of extremist ideologies. Fostering a culture of empathy and understanding toward marginalized groups is essential. Combating hate speech and discrimination through education and awareness campaigns can help dismantle the narratives that fuel fascism. Grassroots movements and organizations advocating for social justice and equality play a crucial role in promoting inclusive societies. Conclusion in conclusion, the rise of fascism in Europe serves as a chilling reminder of the ongoing struggle to maintain democratic ideals in the face of authoritarianism. Understanding the historical context, current trends, 
and underlying factors driving this resurgence is crucial for safeguarding our democratic future. By remaining vigilant, promoting civic engagement, and fostering inclusivity, we can work to ensure that history does not repeat itself. The lessons learned from the past must inform our actions today as we strive to protect the values that uphold democracy.